my boy got the big bags. My boy got the big bags. It's your boy Crypto Million back with another one. And today we're gonna to be talking about Pepe is Elon the king of Pepe. Let me know in the comments. Also, smash that like and subscribe button. Leave a comment. Just interact with the video. It really, really helps the algorithms, family. Let's get straight into it. So, rumor is Polly OX is working with Gemini to create a crypto card for Pepe. So, this is huge, man. This is huge. Now, this is just a rumor. But, it, you know, it, it's, it's, a little, it, it's a little sauce behind that rumor. You can see here, um, Polly is the... Um, see if i can find it oh, 47th holder on pepe holding about 1.3 million dollars of pepe so you know what i'm saying he might he might have that, that type of pull with gemini to make it happen family with a pepe card would you use a pepe card i'd love to know you guys opinions in the comments i know a lot of people you know people about pepe you see people like pepe or people hate pepe it ain't no in between i've been seeing it in the comments but feel free we love we, we appreciate everybody comments be it be positive or negative, I don't judge anybody. You have a right to your opinion. You really do. All right, so let's get into the charts here. You can see Pepe on the four hour because it doesn't, we don't have enough information, family, for the daily. But Pepe has been building out a floor, okay? When we say building out a floor, Pepe has been trading in between the 618 and the 786, okay? Using that 618 as resistance and the 786 here as support. So what this is telling me is that it's always good if you understand how charts work to buy when we hit the 786 and if you're trading sell when we hit the 618 now for me pepe is a long-term hold i feel like pepe is going to be huge but i know a lot of people trade this token and over on this channel we, we try to make everybody happy the holders and the people that's trading so if you're trading pay attention to that floor being built by pepe nothing to worry about unless we break the 786 you can see here on the four hour chart, we are pushing to the upside with the RSI showing that it may have reset and getting a little bullish momentum here on the MACD. But again, uh, cryptocurrency is a very volatile, so keep that in mind. I think Pepe is a, I like Pepe. I like what it's bringing to the cryptocurrency space. Even on the daily chart, you can see we did break this neckline here. Huge triple bottom, huge triple bottom. We got a neckline here. We got a neckline here. If we can break both of these with confidence, Pepe might be setting up for another move to the upside. And when I say another move, an explosive move. Now, let's talk about the rumor here. So Elon Musk, if you don't know, Elon Musk has been in France meeting with the French president. Okay, now why is this a coincidence for Pepe holders? Why does it make sense with Pepe? Well, you can see here, family, Pepe, king of the memes, is located in France. So a lot of people are putting together that, hey, you know, Elon could be working with uh, Pepe, you know, rolling out this Twitter wallet, this Twitter crypto wallet. So there's a lot of rumors out there. Uh, they say the devs are in France. Y'all can believe what y'all want to believe. I don't believe anything until I see it and get some confirmation. But again, this is good for the crypto space because we're seeing a lot of people, you feel me, come together in the crypto space, especially in the meme coin sector from all different walks of life. And again, I feel like Pepe is a uh, can easily hit between a $10 billion and $100 billion market cap. I got a video coming out on Shiba Inu. We got to talk about that. I haven't talked about Shiba in a while. But again... Elon Musk did meet with the French president here and they had a conversation uh, about the electrical vehicle and energy sectors. But what really piqued my interest, family, is they also talked about digital regulation. So there was news out that the uh, SEC is supposed to be cracking down on crypto exchanges. Every time we get some bullish momentum, we start to see the SEC come out, you know, and put their foot down on crypto, really consolidating. And uh, uh, what I want to say is... um. Um, really, really uh, suppressing the market, suppressing the market, because I think that we probably would have broken 30K, 35K if we wouldn't get that negative news from the SEC. Every time they come out, they want to talk about crypto uh, regulation. Now, we do have the macro environment stuff. I know earnings is all throughout this week, but I think Pepe, I think Pepe is here to stay. I know a lot of people doubt it. I personally think Pepe is here to stay. If you were looking to Enter Pepe, I would be looking for uh, the 7A6. So, yeah, this thing has been trading between the 7A6 and 618, really um, um, building a floor here. So, a lot to look forward to. Y'all let me know what y'all think about Pepe, Elon in France, and the potential Pepe card with Pauly allegedly partnering with Gemini, Gemini Exchange. Hey, man, can we get a Coinbase? Coinbase, 
Holla at your boy Robin Hood. We waiting on you, all right? Shout out to the Pepe family. Pepe is love. It's your boy Crypto Millie. I'm out.